The Republic of India is a big country located in southern Asia with an area of 3.3 million square meters and a population of about 1 billion people. In the two centuries, when under the yoke of the colonialism and imperialism, the Indian people stood up to struggle for the right of national independence. Inspired by Mahatma Gandhi and his Satyagraha, along with Jawaharlal Nehru, India threw up the yoke of British rule on the 15th of August 1947. Three years later, on the 26th of January 1950, the Republic of India officially came into existence and started a new era of national construction. Nowadays, the Republic of India has the most populous democracy on earth with universal adult suffrage. The Indian people is proud of its nation's over 5,000 year long history and culture. The spectacular architectural art based on the religious foundation is shown in towers and temples constructed everywhere in India like the magnificent Brihadeshwara Temple in Tanjavur, Hoyasala Temples in Belur, and Halibut in Karnataka, Kajuraho in Madhya Pradesh, and Kunar in Orissa, etc. The gods worshipped and the statues illustrating the religious life since the ancient time are evidence of the folk nature in the great traditional culture and in the Indian people. The exchange and influence of the Indian culture has spread over an immense space, especially up to South Asian countries. From ancient time, the ancient cultures in Vietnam interacted considerably with Indian culture through the sea trade brought by Indian mercantile ships. Hoi An used to be one of the hectic trading centers at that time. Goods like silk, pottery, and ceramic items and Indian ornaments were exchanged mainly to satisfy the demand of aristocratic circles and feudal kings and mandarins. During the excavation of ancient sites of Dongsan civilization, have found some glass or agate ornaments with very clear Indian origin. Especially in Ok El, the relics and statues bear the influence of Hinduism and Indian Buddhism which has proven the influence of Indian culture right from the beginning of the restoration of the independence and freedom, and has contributed to the glorious development of Vietnamese culture. The mercantile ships of Indian businessmen with Buddhist monks arrived in Zhaozhou, and influence of the Indian culture affected many aspects of life, both material life and spiritual life, especially Buddhism in that area. Buddhism of India has been spread out to Vietnam since the ancient time. Buddhism from the primordial time was considered a source of creation for peace. Buddhist thoughts are one of the elements which have made the close relationship for the two Vietnamese and Indian peoples. The friendship between President Ho Chi Minh and Jawaharlal Nehru is considered a beautiful image of the friendly solidarity. Nearly 2,000 years after coming to Vietnam, Buddhism has been harmoniously adopted in the way of life and thought of Vietnamese people. Up to now, essence of those thoughts are altruism and honesty, which give us a strong belief in a bright future.